All right, here we are for round two. Uh, we actually just started right away, which is pretty cool. My, my, my other accidental tournament is actually still in round one somehow. Um, this is a great hand. We have Elvish Mystic into Death and Raptor, even if they are grayed out by Magic's Online's interface for whatever reason. Uh, we're gonna keep this for sure. It is awesome. Uh, <laughs> Mystic Monastery once again. Our opponents are all playing Mystic Monasteries. I imagine this one is unlikely to be quite as uh, odd as the last one. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and cast a Raptor. Anticipate. Okay. Hmm. If this is like just guy tokens, just guy control. Uh, just gonna uh, get beaten about the head and shoulders with a Surak Hunt Collar. Because that's what I hope to be playing against. <laughs> Valorous Dance. Rude. Very rude. Maybe I, I could have played like Avatar the Resolute there. And uh, he couldn't have killed it with Valorous Dance. But if I played that, then if he has, I mean, I, I, if he has like a, what is this, this the lightning strike, I'm trying to remember what, the searing spear, or whatever it was called. Oh dear. Rabble Master can be a problem card uh, for a creature deck like this one. When you don't really have great ways to defend yourself from it. Okay, this could be a problem. We're getting stoked. Anticipated. No. Okay. He didn't play anything there. He had a sp if he had a spell that he could cast, I imagine he very likely would have cast it. Can we just, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, can we just kill him? Because if he had, I think he had like Anticipate, he would have cast it there. If he had Lightning Strike, I think there's a reasonable chance he would have cast it there. So now we have plus seven for each of these. We have nine attack. So yeah, I'm just gonna attack with these. Hopefully he doesn't have another Valorous stance. Uh, so this is 13, 14, 15, 16. I'm gonna try and kill him. Oh, he has a Valor stance, okay. Hmm. I guess it's a card that he, he you know, could not have played there. Um, I'm not gonna block here. Yeah. Yeah, that's a card that, that was not playable on his attack. Nope. Stick doesn't really have great ways to, to deal with that. Uh, Ranger's Guile is obviously gonna be potentially excellent there. Basic forest, you don't really cut it. Oh, he's looting. He could be in trouble. I'm getting double spelled. Or just single spelled and traded off with. Stoke? This is a stoke. 
on my raptor. All right. Uh, we are in trouble now, as we have nothing but land. He's at five, but opponent has a rabble. Oh god, we're super dead. Oh, yeah, we have no reach that can break through this at this point. So yeah, I mean, the second Valor Stance, I feel like I kind of had to go for that. It's not like we have any way to really bait, um, to really bait his removal. Yeah, I'm dead. I can play, well, I guess I'm not dead. I can cast this. We can't actually cast it face down because we need to block with it or, or else we die. Any spell, we're dead. Okay, we're dead. So this is actually a matchup where we really do want um, uh, Ranger's Guiles. Uh, Gather Courage, I think, is actually also probably pretty good. I wonder if... Sorok seems pretty bad. I wonder if I just want Collected Companies. Become Immense seems dangerous to be trying to play too many of. Reclamation Stage seems good. Back to Nature seems good. Sorok seems kind of clunky. Especially when we're playing against Stokes and Valorous Stances. I think I just want Collected Companies. I don't think I want Nelia's Disciple. It's not really like a burn deck. It's more of a... Um, more of a like combo style deck. You know, they, they assemble a sort of critical mass of stuff and then kill you with that. It's not like you're... Uh, it's not like you are, uh, you know, getting burned out narrowly or anything like that. Um, I just want to take out a server to the scale because they are like the lowest impact cards. They don't seem like they're good here. It's not like they're not like big blocking anything. Is there anything else I do want in the deck? This kind of Hydro is not going to be good. They have like Valor Stance and just one, you know, one one red creatures and uh, and white creatures. All right, maybe maybe Gather Courage over this server of the scale. Yeah, maybe that maybe that's sweet. Just like sometimes able to save your guys from burn or something like that. Let's give it a shot. This is a this is a matchup where I would definitely like to have all of the ranger skiles possible. Um, this is a kind of an awkward and weak hand. I don't think I want to mulligan it though. Like we don't have we don't have any of our like good early drops, but I don't think that this is a hand we really can afford to be mulliganing. I think maybe we just play a face up den protector on two. We just hope to draw a better card to play, but. Yeah, I'm just gonna play a face up down protector. Like I can't like try and maximize value here, especially when I just have a Reverend Hunter who I really need to play as well as my only other threat. Um, maybe, it, maybe I'm playing Boon Seder instead. There's any reason to like cast Boon Seder now? Could have like Anger of the Gods or something in his deck. All right, we're gonna cast Boon Seder. Five, and that would be four four. Uh, four four is good enough. Doesn't that anger the gods, which is kind of what I'm scared of? That would be five five. Never mind. Yes, yeah, because plus four plus four. Let's say go. There's anger. Yep, but our Reverend Hunter survives. Okay. Oh, okay. Does not does not survive. Just kidding. Um, we'll face down this one. 
Definitely need another land to play this collected company. Anger the gods again. Well, that's kind of rude. The gods are not happy. I guess I'm just playing this. Yeah, I thought that I was safe because I had a way to. Oh, Dragon Lord. Nice. Gonna say go and plan to collect the company and step or whatever seems appropriate. The anger plus wild slash is really brutal. Like if I had if I had anticipated, you know, that um, I may have played, you know, a bit differently, clearly, but I don't really know what their options. I really kinda just wish I had and, you know, one additional mana source or whatever. Dragon fodder. Okay. The Jeskai Ascendancy plus, uh, plus Dragon Lord of is pretty brutal. All right, well, we will call the company for, ooh, maybe I should, yeah, well, we'll get Reclamation Sage. And Avatar, I guess. What about Boon Seder and Avatar? Because we have Aspect of Hydra. I think about Reclamation Sage. Because we want to kill. We want to kill the Jeskai Ascendancy. Well, he's not even having land at least. Um, so now this is plus four. Okay, he's stoking. Ugh. Jesus. This is brutal. Well, we no longer have a trampler. Which is kind of trouble, kind of troublesome. Reverend Hunter would be a 4-4. Four, four. Uh, this Dragon Lord is just going to crush us. There's too many, so many guys in play now, and I no longer have a trampler. If I had a trampler, I'd actually be in reasonable shape because I have I have multiple aspect of hydras and a ranger's guile, and I'd be able to, you know, trample over whatever whatever he blocked with. But now, now we're in trouble. I think I just play Reverend Hunter. It's only a three. There, it's a yeah. No, it's a four four. It's at least yeah. I guess I play it. At least like big enough that it isn't embarrassed by Ojatai. I gotta attack into these guys. Just die at two attacks from Ojatai here though. I don't really have time. Oh, okay, another just guy sentency. May just be dead now. So there's that was secure the waste. Oh my god, okay. Well if he just has a spell, I'm dead. That's well, not a bad sequence of, of draws from no cards, is a sentence to secure the ways. Mm. 
Yeah, he did get a Dragon Lord Tide Trigger there, so. Yeah, I'm just dead. I mean, he gets Trump Walk and. <laughs> that, uh. A couple of turns here that were pretty much the big, you know, sort of swing moments of the game. Like him having the Anger plus Wild Slash to clear my board, including my 5 5. Um, you know, it was obviously, obviously a big deal. And then him having the uh, Stoke when he tapped out with the Ascendancy and I otherwise would have had a Trampler in play. Yeah, you know, I didn't have mana to protect it well with Ranger's Guile or Aspect. Um, if he hadn't had it right there, I think I actually win that game because I'm able to just double Aspect plus Ranger's Guile for whatever sort of removal he may have when he it, it does come to it. And uh, trample over whatever blockers he has. But the way things lined up didn't work out that way. Um, all right, well, I think this, is, this, this matchup is probably... Yeah, you know, it's it's gonna be pretty tough if they do have like anger. Anger's super good against you. Um, game one, you know, we obviously just the second Valor stance uh, when we had a hand that was just a bunch of pump spells. We had kind of, I kind of felt like I had to go for it. Um, I can't just sit there while my opponent has just guy ascendancy in play and you know try and like set something up. I'm not gonna find a better moment when I only have one uh, Ranger Scout on the deck. So uh, anyway, let's uh, let's head and play uh, play another uh, two player match. It's still my other even. Tournament hasn't even started yet, or I don't even know what's going on. Anyway, um, yeah, let's go. Mm. 